what I mean about glasses. So, Julian Evis in the last contest tonight. Against Michael Smythe. Michael Smythe last boxed here when we was down here on the uh, Regan Bill. Southpaw Julian Evis. Has fought nearly everybody in the world weight division at the moment. We had, we had a little chat with him earlier on, and uh, he's willing to fight anyone, Julian Evis, isn't he? Oh, that's right. I mean, he was telling me earlier that he hasn't got anyone to spar with. The, the only sparring he gets is when he actually boxes. This is his 50th, 51st fight tonight, and uh, he's hoping to win. A lot of people have said like he doesn't get involved, but you don't need to. It's an awkward style. I'm, the, last time, the last time I actually saw Julian is when he fought Benny Collins down at Reading. And uh, that was a good contest for him. I thought he well won it, but the decision went to the homeboy, Benny Collins. Public do like to see an action type fighter, but the art of boxing is to be to hit and not get hit, Eric, isn't it? That's right, yeah, but I don't think many people realise this. Well, me and you do. Yeah. But as you say, I mean, I've seen him before, but he has got a um, very ungainly looking style, hasn't he? Yeah, no doubt. <laughs> to the corner of Julian Evis. Wash your brush up treatment. Second round, scheduled for six two-minute rounds between uh, Julian Evis and Michael Smythe. Julian Evis has a very ungainly looking style. Michael Smythe looking to get hold of uh, Julian Evis and hurt him. But Evis won't let that happen, I'm sure. Michael Smythe, to me, seems to be hesitating just a little bit too much if he wants to get hold of uh, Julian Evis. And Evis is not actually doing enough, throwing enough punches back to win the rounds. Julian's looking to spoil, which is his game. Work from the spoils, from the clinches, punching as he comes out. 
Michael Smythe <laughs> is uh, getting a little bit frustrated as we go back to his corner. Referee just had a quiet little word with him, I don't know what that was about. Smythe is definitely looking to uh, corner Julian Evis and try and hurt him. But every time he does that, Evis holds on to him, spoils him. Pushes and Chavez. I think Michael Smythe is uh, getting very frustrated with Julian Evis. And I can't really blame him because Julian Evis is a very frustrating guy to fight. Every time Smythe gets close, Julian Evis holds on to him, stops him from working effectively. And that's what's giving Smythe the ump. <laughs> Referee's having a word with him, telling him to tidy it up a little bit. It is a very scrappy contest. <laughs> It's easy to see why Julian doesn't get hurt that much because uh, every time he gets Breton to he's uh, holding on, spoiling and stopping the other guy from working. Schedule for six, three to go. Between Michael Smythe with the blue shorts and Julian Evis with the red and green. Oh, Evis is down. Doesn't think it was a punch, but it looked like it was to me. He was off balance, but it was a punch nevertheless, but the referee didn't rule it as such. I think Smythe's hurting Julian Evis now. Julian Evis is in a little bit of trouble. Smythe's stepping up the pressure now, trying to stop Evis. And if Evis don't do something, the ref's going to stop it. Oh, 
missed and slipped. Wipes his gloves, lets him continue. Julian Evers must be such a frustrating guy to fight. He's all arms and legs. Every time Michael Smythe looks to be uh, Getting on top, Julian Evers ties him up, stops him from working effectively. Or doing anything, but I must say Smythe is winning the contest on my card. beginning to thin out as we come to the last two rounds of this contest, the final contest of the evening. The six times two minute rounds. Smythe is, is really frustrated with Julian Evers. He doesn't like his style at all. And I think if it was outside the pub, he'd look to put the boot in. I think the referee's having a word with him about holding. He's having a word with both fighters to calm it down a bit. As I say, this contest after the main event would be a, a little bit of a letdown anyway, but I think their styles are clashing and it's not making for a very interesting fight at all. Right, Smythe's coming on a bit now. I'm not sure if Julian's hurt or he's looking to hold on. 